going on, A Squad? Welcome back to another video, guys. Today is, a, you know, one of the videos that are different every now and then. And I think it's uh, this is the only way to start off the new year, letting you guys know what my goals throughout the year are going to be and what my goals ending 2018 were. Uh, when I set them whenever they, when the year originally started. Um, so in 2018, beginning of 2018, man. I, I had just started finally growing with some actual consistent growth. Uh, thanks to, as you guys probably know, the Realms SMP. This is whenever I was first brought into it. Uh, still love these guys, the whole block. They're all amazing people. So, again, huge shout out for them to letting me join the block. You know, because without this, honestly, I don't, I don't know if I would have had this growth. And I don't know if I'd still be doing YouTube. 2018 was definitely a rough year. For me, but it was also one of the best. Uh, I, I went through, had some pretty great experiences, but also had some pretty, pretty rough experiences. But it's also good to have these brand new experiences, and I think that's what made it so much better uh, than all the worst stuff combined. So, like I said, beginning of 2018, man, I was around 3,000. Uh, I hit 4K on my birthday, January 12th. Um, and then after that, it was just a continuous, steady growth of, of just keep on moving up on the subs. So I was pretty happy with that, man. Uh, and I took, I got too comfortable with it. I, I definitely got too comfortable with the growth. Um, but as I've been skipping around, it my goal for the end of 2018 originally was 25,000, and we didn't even get 5k away from that. So we we were we ended the year at like 19,000. 895 something like that so we were a hundred and like five away from 20k so that's five five thousand one hundred plus away from my original goal and that's i'm definitely to blame for that you know i, I definitely slacked off I, I think i definitely could have had a lot better i know i would have definitely got there if i uh or at least been way closer like at least a thousand or two away if I wouldn't have uh, taken my, I guess, break in October and November was kind of an off upload schedule for me too. So now I'm going to explain that. With this whole move down or up to Washington, uh, it, it was hard finding a job. It definitely was hard finding a job. And uh, it took, gosh, a month and a half. I was without a job for almost two months, if not two months. And that really got me behind. Uh, I'm pretty sure I explained this in a video a while back but once you get so far behind and you're only getting paid so much to start off you just keep on falling down that hole you're not getting enough to get you out of that hole every paycheck and so you're spending that paycheck trying to get you some food and survive for the two weeks you're waiting on your next paycheck and just keep your car running and uh, so so I eventually get in a, uh, a promotion at my work and that's where we're at kind of now I'm figuring out what and how I need to plan out my videos. So pretty much is what I'm saying is I'm still trying to adjust to being a YouTuber who's actually becoming successful. I wouldn't say I'm successful yet. I'm st starting to find what's successful on YouTube and starting to figure out the algorithm and realizing what I need to be doing. And uh, so I'm still trying to figure out my time management. Time management is one of my 2018 resolutions something that I really need to figure out because without my time management guys I'm gonna be completely just all over the place and it's not gonna look good it's not looking good that's why October and November were just a complete worst months on YouTube for me this year uh, that and with YouTube messing up so much in October that really just demotivated me and that's why you really didn't upload a lot so I want to apologize for that whole October and beginning of November kind of fiasco. That was just really poor judgment of me. I got caught up in Red Dead Redemption and Call of Duty. They had both just come out then. And uh, I wasn't really worried about Minecraft, which I should have been. This is what I want to do. This is what I enjoy and everything. So now I'm starting to figure out my routine, my daily routine at work, uh, what I do. You know, s Saturdays and Sundays I could usually stream. Uh, in the late afternoon after 3 p.m. or I guess yeah 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time 
and then uh, Mondays and Fridays I usually have off so I could usually those are usually my days to record and stream as well um, so now that I know what my schedule is now we're gonna go into my goals for the end of 2019 so with if as long as everything keeps going up as it has been and hopefully steadily increasing itself at the same time I'm hoping by the end of 2019 guys now this might seem like a huge crazy goal because I know some of the youtubers are only setting a subscriber goal of five to ten thousand more and you know sure that maybe that's all they think they can grow that year but I'm thinking I could get to at least 100k I think I could grow 80,000 subscribers in a year and uh, it's, it's it might be rough but I think I could do it easily and uh, well not necessarily easy it's definitely gonna take a lot of work and uh, that's something I got to figure out again what and how I need to do there what I need to do to get there so 100,000 subscribers right now we are at only 19,906 and I want to get at least 5 million channel views so we are you know at 789,000 right now this is all outdated I need to update that <laughs> um, so we are pretty much four four million four million channel views away and you know that could be one viral banger it really could one one video could get four million views on it if it does that's freaking awesome and that's I, I, I I'll reach part of my goal but as of right now my channel only has less than a million and I think a four million increase would be pretty awesome so I'm setting my goal for about five million channel views 100,000 subscribers I want to get my Instagram to let's say at what 3,000 followers as well because I, I don't post a lot on there but I'm gonna try to as well my Twitter to probably 5,000 I want to get that Twitter to 5,000 this year so I'm gonna be posting some more a lot more on there stuff like that um, maybe even I don't know if I'm gonna vlog a lot I'm not too into the vlogging right now especially with my work schedule maybe on like uh, trips and stuff like that but I want to get to my second channel also uh, pumping out content maybe some more Roblox over there because um, I know some of you guys did enjoy the Roblox so some Roblox is gonna be coming out uh, maybe some Fortnite maybe some more Call of Duty if I want to get in a capture card for my Xbox so I could produce Xbox Minecraft related content and post that on my main channel so a huge shout out again to Xbox for sending me that um, sorry guys I'm trying to work on getting the uh, capture card the Elgato for that so uh, I could produce that type of content and hot, better quality stuff on the PC as well because apparently it, it just looks better if you have the Elgato capture card so hopefully I could get that so uh, that's what I'm gonna try working on this year hopefully I can get that later um, but again, I want to try to get in this channel to a thousand subscribers. So I'm going to be trying to post on there. I know a thousand isn't that much more of an increase, but uh, you know, I, that's something again, I don't plan on uploading a lot on just uh, whenever I can, just to keep it consistent. You know, try to get that channel monetized as well. That this year that'd be pretty awesome. So a thousand views for what was it, four thousand hours of watch time or something like that? Maybe it's four thousand or forty thousand. Um, or 40 I, I don't know but whatever I want to get that channel monetized maybe just some Fortnite, maybe some more smite maybe some overwatch that was fun for a little bit um, but yeah Roblox for sure is gonna be coming back guys you guys seem to like that one that was a little bit better uh, I think yeah, that was a stream but yeah so Roblox is gonna be coming to this channel a hundred thousand subscribers on my main channel that's the main thing that I wanted to come here and talk to you guys about um, but yeah so uh, thank you guys for all the amazing support this past few weeks um, support on the streams have been insane the realm series you guys are loving that so more realms is definitely on the way um, Again, thank you guys I actually uh, did a prank on double a 12 in the stream I did on New Year's Eve, but I'm gonna upload that as a whole nother video to let everybody know and I guess to let him know because he probably doesn't know that I pranked him uh, on the realms Because he probably didn't watch that nine nine and a half hour stream <laughs> But uh, yeah guys so if you, guys, if you guys didn't see that guys we streamed nine and a half hours yesterday on New Year's Eve we did Roblox uh, a, a small segment of ASMR uh, it was a whole nine hours and 32 minutes we got so close to 20k how close did we get yeah I think we ended it off with uh, 19,896 okay, yes. okay, dang so that was 
That was insane, I, guys. So again, I'm that was such exhausted. a fun and amazing stream. Uh, Skyscraft, he actually donated me fifty dollars. So uh, I'm gonna, you know, shout out his channel here. Thank you so much for that donation, Skies. Um, it really does mean a lot. Go subscribe, guys. He has 149 subscribers. And, uh, yeah, guys, so I'm going to end up the video there. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy this little sit-down video, this one-on-one -on -one talk, let me know because I'd be interested in doing some more of these, maybe some storytelling stuff if you guys want to see some more of that. Um, let me know. Um, and, uh, yeah, this, this is like a, a better connection with you guys, I feel like. So, again, and thank you guys for an amazing 2018. We're going to take over 2019. This is our year. And I'll see you guys on the top.